Okay, listen up everybody, we'll be moving on to our next weight classification of clan battle decks. We're starting with the lightest of them so far, the 60 ton Vulture. Information is as follows. With its hunched shoulders and protruding head looking so much like a vulture, it earned the nickname in two places at the same time. This mech has one of the most distinctive looks of any. Tagged the vulture by the Free Roselhag Republic at the same time it was in the Draconis Combine, it means Hagataga, the same thing. This mech's bird legs enhance the comparison. This appearance is so striking that it must have been intentional. The huge twin missile racks on its shoulders give the mech its hunched look, but the overall appearance has changed little when most of the weapon pods are installed. In its primary configuration, the Vulture serves mostly as a fire support mech. Many Innisphere warriors have remarked about the sense of foreboding they felt looking up to and seeing a Vulture perched on a ridge, firing its missiles on the raging battle below and waiting for victims to die before it swooped down for the carrion. The twin racks of 20 long-range missiles can certainly hasten along an enemy's death, and should the Vulture injure an enemy at long range, it can take fate into its own hands, or in this case its arms, and use its laser weapons to finish off its foe. Alternate configuration A is similar in appearance to the primary setup, but very different in function. Three incredible layers of SRM-6 launchers replace the LRM racks on each shoulder, giving this version of the Vulture immense muscle at short range. The autocannon and PPC in the arms can bear the enemy a little longer until the Vulture can bring its missiles to bear. A hybrid between these two, at least in its concept from what we can tell, is alternate configuration B. Refinements include streak technology for its SRMs and an Artemis fire control system for the long range launcher. The arms are a mixture, with three medium pulses in the right and two extended range large in the left. So different in appearance that Innisphere mech warriors originally have thought it a separate mech, the C variant of the Vulture doesn't even look like the bird. Lacking the familiar missile racks, the Vulture C has two powerful Gauss rifles. So bulky are these weapons that this model must carry the ammunition in its puny arms. The weight requirements prevent this C model from carrying any other weaponry, and only by careful study of videos did strategists identify the leg and torso structure of this design as those of the Vulture. Deployment-wise, it's first seen in the Draconis Combine and shortly thereafter in the Razalhag Republic. The Vulture has since appeared with all clans. Ghost Bears use it with the greatest frequency, but Smoke Jaguar also favour this mech. The Vulture is somewhat less common but by no means rare with the other warrior clans.